leader of the Elder Council, a powerful battle mage and a shrewd politician. With his council, Darren was able to seize the Imperial throne years before. Manamarco the traitor, the great enemy, the most powerful necromancer this world has ever known. His worm cult infiltrates and corrupts every corner of Tamriel. It was he who convinced Varen to perform the ritual you are about to witness. Disaster, war, and pestilence. A world brought to its knees. Now watch and see how one man's arrogance brought about the greatest threat our world has ever known. Fire Brazier. Manimarco, you certain this will work? It will work, my liege. The Amulet of Kings will rekindle the dragon fires and ensure your rightful place as Emperor. You have my word. It better work, Manimarco, or you'll find your neck at the business end of my axe. My lord, I wonder if you'd muzzle your half giant pet. She really is annoying. Enough, both of you. We are here to ensure my lord's rightful claim to the Ruby Throne. Abner, begin the ritual. I have a destiny to fulfill. Yeah. By the lighting of the dragon fires, I claim my rightful lineage. By the fires of creation, let me be reborn. By the will of Akatosh, I proclaim myself Dragonborn. You will pay for your sacrilege! The veil between Tamriel and Oblivion tears and splits asunder! What's happening? The sky is opening up. This is bad. This is very bad. Ah! This isn't supposed to happen. What's the meaning of this? Manny Marco, what have you done? Gulliver fools! The veil between Oblivion and this world has been torn! My master, Moloch Baal, is free to claim Camriel for his own. Akatosh, forgive me! Have mercy on our souls! The ritual tore the veil between Nairn and Oblivion allowing Manamarco to begin stealing the souls his master needed to power the Dark Anchors and initiate the Plain Melt. Akatosh gave Alessia the Amulet of Kings as a symbol of his covenant with Nan. So long as the amulet remained in the care of Alessia's heirs, 